Cardiac arrhythmia is a simple term, irregular heartbeat. The part that we study is the abnormally slow heart rhythm, and that's called bradyarrhythmia. So when the heart rate is slow, we feel very tired. If it is too slow, then we will actually lose consciousness. When that happens in a prolonged period of time, then it can be life-threatening. There is only one way to treat that symptom, and that's implanting a device. It reasonably works really well, but it, in pediatric patients, this becomes even more problem because they don't have a lot of space to have this implanted on the chest area. The duration of the pacing is not 10 or 20 years, it's the entire lifetime. It forces them into invasive surgeries that can cause higher risk of infection. So there are many reasons to think about and uh, come up with different therapy than a device-dependent rhythm management. And we look at the heart. We are interested in how the heart can beat on its own. So what is the best pacemaker? And without a question, the best pacemaker is one that we are born with. There are only a handful of genes that are important for forming the pacemaker cells that we are born with. If we take those human genes and then express that in ordinary heart muscle, will we be able to convert that muscle into pacemaker cells? And lo and behold, we were fortunate that one of those genes was able to carry out exactly that function. We want this technology to be able to make an impact in the lives of the patients, both pediatric and adult patients. To be able to do that, we need to show that we can create new pacemaker cells in the dish. We need to show that these newly created pacemaker cells can pace diseased heart in small animals. And we need to show that the same thing can happen in large animals in a clinically relevant model. We have demonstrated all of them. Data indicate that a single injection of this gene can convert the heart muscle to the pacemaker tissue. We have reasons to be optimistic that this is going to be as minimally invasive as possible. And this will be able to pace the animal and later on the patients for months and years.